again, friends. It's Carrie. Thanks for joining me for another video here on my channel. If you're new here, welcome. I'm glad you found me, and I'd love for you to stick around and subscribe. I've got another Mama Chat kind of video for you today. Just going to talk to you about some things that I'm considering. Oof, there's a bug. <laughs> and I want to know your feedback on it. I want to know what would be most helpful to you because these videos are work. I have to record these all at once on one afternoon while my kids play with their aunt and it just it's it's hard to fit in sometimes but I'm happy to do it because you all say it's helpful and that's my main goal I want to be helpful so I want some feedback on this I want you guys to comment down below on your thoughts and what would be most helpful to you all and I'll kind of use the comments to help me guide my decision so if you follow me on Instagram you know that I am considering uh, getting off of Facebook and Instagram and just having a YouTube account. Now, this isn't a firm decision is made kind of thing. I am seeking uh, some feedback from you guys and trying to see what would be most helpful. But I am considering this and it has really nothing to do with the, with the current uh, landscape of people fleeing one social media platform and going to another one um, out of just different concerns of censorship and things like that. I'm not agreeing or denying that that happens. It, it's, you know, uh, that's a different discussion one I really don't want to have here. But I, I came to this decision prior to this and just didn't, you know, kind of go with it. I, I really felt that I wanted to get down to one social media platform and share there and hopefully you all can find me there. But when I got into creating a YouTube channel and writing a blog, everything I was learning from other people who had done the same was you have to create all of these profiles on all of these different social media platforms and get your, get your information out there that way so that you can reach people and help. And so that's what I did. I created all of these different accounts and tried to share things on and, and all those different platforms. And to be honest, I just don't have the time to fully keep up with all of these platforms. <clears throat> Excuse me. And my biggest audience is here on YouTube. This is where I feel like I can bring the most value to the homeschool community by the way of reviews and flip throughs and how I would change things up and things like that. So I know I want to keep YouTube because that's where I'm helping the most people. So if you're watching this and worried on YouTube, rest assured um, this channel isn't going anywhere in the near future. But I am considering uh, kind of parting with my Facebook account for Any Day Blessings and my Instagram account from Any Day Blessings. Now, I was going to keep Instagram and then recently YouTube just rolled out shorts and they're basically like little stories. They're, those are stories um, function too on YouTube, but I am nowhere near big enough of a channel to have it. I think you have to have 10,000 subscribers or something to have access to create stories here on YouTube. So maybe someday if y'all subscribe, I'll get big enough that I can use the stories function on YouTube. But for now, I kind of found a little workaround that I can create short videos and those will, as you like them, they will start to come up in your shorts videos section on your home screen for YouTube when you open the app or you open the page on your computer. So I can use that as kind of my stories function for now and keep everything here on YouTube. This would allow me to kind of put all my content into one place. You wouldn't have to go to multiple places to find my content and I would just have to keep up with one thing and that would be very freeing to me <laughs> as a busy mom but I don't want people to um, uh, miss out if, if, this, if these kinds of tips and things are helpful to you. So I need you to comment down below and let me know if I was to get rid of everything but YouTube and just have a presence on YouTube and my blog, if that would like, you know, really mess up how you get content from me. Now I know that because all of you are watching YouTube, that probably you're gonna say, oh yeah, that's fine, but I'm thinking that there's probably a good overlap of people that are here and on my other social media platforms. So I'm going to put this here. I've already put this on my Instagram account and the majority, I think like 45 of you answered and only five of you weren't following me here as well as Instagram. So I think that 
while that's not you know the whole sampling of my channel I think that's gonna be true for a lot of you I think a lot of you are probably following me here and on Instagram however if that's not the case if you primarily keep up with things on Instagram and find my most valuable content there and just kind of sporadically come over here to YouTube and you would prefer that I keep Instagram then please let me know that and let me know if if there is, are certain things about Facebook or Instagram and my content there, which is very similar to what I have here, but if, if there's something about it that you feel I could try to bring over here to YouTube so that y'all aren't missing out. So that's all I wanted to talk about today. Just wanted to get some feedback for, for you guys and let you know that if you do see me go away on Instagram and Facebook, that I'm still going to be here on YouTube and the main reason I'm kind of downsizing is so that I can invest more here and make this better, okay? So that's all, I'm not going anywhere uh, by God's grace. It's my plan to maintain this channel and my blog and um, very likely letting some other things online go. So i love to hear from you. Please, please let me know down in the comments your thoughts on this so that I can make the appropriate changes to benefit the most of you. And I will catch you in the next video.